guys, I'm gonna show you today how to assemble Tysil double bed from IKEA. I hope you enjoyed the video. If yes, thumbs up, subscribe to my channel as always, you will make my day. And let's do the job now. We're starting with the back panel of the bed, two screws, one on each side, and two wooden plugs on each of the side panels. Lock one on each side of the side panel. Don't forget to point the arrow in the right direction and place them in. We can join the back panel with the side panels. Secure the lock. Exactly the same on the other side. Just tap it in and secure the lock. This is the leg for the back part of the bed. Three pieces of metal joined together with the two screws on each side. Just secure the screws and we can place it on the back panel of the bed. We're gonna secure it with the eight screws. Four of them they go into the side panels. Four of them they're gonna go in the back panel. So that's how the frame is secured from one side. This is the side panel side, four screws and we can turn the bed around so the leg is gonna be where it's supposed to be on the floor. We have it upside down just because of the leg, it's easier to do it that way. Two wooden plugs, this is the front part of the bed, two wooden plugs on each side panels. This is the front panel, just place it in. There's no screws for now, just tap it in with the wooden plugs holding it only. This is the headboard of the bed. Two dividing panels secured with the two screws on each side of the dividing panel. And we can place it, get it ready. Okay, this is the plastic with the nut. Just place the nut in the plastic. That's how we're gonna secure the headboard to the main frame. Just place it in, put it in the right direction. So the screw is gonna go through the nut. So place the headboard, there is two long screws straight through the metal side of the headboard and going straight to the bed frame. If the screw doesn't go straight in, probably the plastic with the nut is uh, twisted wrong. So just turn it slightly left or right and you should find right the holes and you can secure the headboard to the bed frame. That's it. This is gonna be the rail which is holding the whole bag. So the bed frame is gonna be connected with the bottom of the bed. Two screws on the top and one on the bottom. Two metal brackets, one at the front, one at the back. Panel, secure them with the screws and you can place two small screws on the sides. I'm gonna explain you later what for it is. This is L-shaped long rail along the side panels, secured with the screws. This is gonna go hold the wooden slots, so make sure the screws are attached properly all the way through. Two small screws, place them two on one side and two on the other side of the rail. This is the plastic stoppers, gonna stop the slots from the sliding up and down. So we just screw with the plastic on the top and this is the rails which they're gonna hold the bed in the right position you're gonna have four of these so there is those two small screws attach them there one on the rail one on the front and back panel and secure it on the middle so at this point you should have the bed in the right position which it means 90 degrees in each corner and secure secure it with those four rails Two screws, one in the brackets, one on the side panel and one on the middle. This is the mid beam. There is uh, two stoppers on each side, exactly the same, just screw through the mid beam and the plastic on the other side, which is gonna stop uh, the slots from sliding on the middle. 
and we can place them in beam at the front and hook it on the back as well. Wooden slots, just slide them in, place them on the stoppers, the front and on the back. Exactly the same on the other side. And the mattress. All done. Okay guys, and this is it. This is the tricycle double bed from IKEA. Hope you enjoyed the video. Yes, thumbs up, subscribe to my channel as always. You will make my day and see you in my next one very very soon. Thank you for watching. Have a beautiful day. <coughs>